Kowalski and Alexandria have finally released their new single titled Into the Fire. So if you do not know what happened the past couple years, I will briefly tell you what pretty much happened. So while the band was making From Death to Destiny, their singer Danny, he did not want to do the screams at all and so they made that album and then Danny left and uh, then they brought in in this dude named Dennis Stoff and they made the black and then Dennis pretty much said fuck y'all and he left the 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 band and the band did not know what to do and so the band asked a Danny, Danny to come back and well he came back. I'm not a fan of the black at all. It is not that it is a bad album. I just I just um do not like the singer's voice at all. And I also think that the um album compared to From Death to Destiny is such a immature metalcore album. It is such a immature metalcore album in my opinion. So if um you liked asking Val Alexandria's past three albums, I'm talk talking about Stand Up and Scream, Reckless and Relentless, and From Death to Destiny you're probably not going to like this song because this song is such a different song from this band. The sound of this song is um, nothing we have ever heard from this band at all. The uh, closest to the sound is is um, from the album From Death to Destiny. For the song itself, like I said, it is called Into the Fire. And it is an extremely good song. The song starts out with a guitar riff and uh, then the drums come in too. And then to hear Danny's voice on this on this song and just in a Asking Alexandria song, it is so pleasing to my ears. Like I said, I did not like the black at all. I did not like the singer's voice at all. And just to hear Danny's voice is so refreshing. Now I know that a lot of fans they 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 were pretty pissed off that Danny came back because they they thought, thought, thought that he would try to change change a band because right now he is doing this um classic rock band we are harlot and uh, then he's doing this southern rock thing I don't even know what it's called. A lot of fans were scared that he would try tr tr try to change the band into like, like, into like this country rock band. And with this song, that does not happen at all. In this song, I do think at times that the guitar that the guitar riff is pretty boring. Like I said, I love Danny's vocals so much and I also love the chorus so much I love Danny singing so much and then at the end of the song is the best part of the song a lot of people were scared that Danny would change his band and at the end of the song Danny proves them all wrong he he uh, brings in the screams and it is not like the screams from like Stand up and scream, and um, reckless and relentless. It is more of the screams from from death to destiny, and I love it so much. From death to destiny is my favorite album by this band. Overall, I just think that the song is the perfect way to welcome back Danny into this band because, like I said. This song is amazing. Vinnit is probably one one of their best songs they have ever wrote. As always, thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed. Comment your thoughts. Make sure to subscribe if you're new. And yeah guys, it's me John. Later.